this festival of football underway. The Blues did not hesitate to accept the invitation to come to a view that they played on a few times before, of course. But it is a special night, a special occasion. Barcelona in possession, just uh, making way down the right-hand side. And the first save of the match is made by Ortega, diving to his left-hand side and carrying it out of harm's way. City have just won the ball back in the centre circle, and they've got a chance to have a go, and they are doing, with Alvarez trying to get round a couple of players. He lays it off to Mares. Mares brings in Sergio Gomez, and out it goes to Foden, and City trying to mount an attack, but... Oh, they've scored! It was a howler! Iñaki Peña in the goal, just presents it to Alvarez. And City have a bonus lead. It was a very simple ball to field for the goalkeeper. City take the lead, Michael, in bizarre circumstances. Yeah, I was just about to actually say it wasn't a great ball. And Gomez had a lot of time. Goalkeeper went so easy, just switched off. It's almost hit Alvarez. Can't believe his luck. If you just watch the replay back. It's almost too easy, too slow. He's already thinking, where am I going to throw it? Who can I get away? as it hits into Alvarez, simple, right on the line, it's to put City ahead, I mean, it's amazing at this level that you would see such a mistake like that. So they now to the halfway line and making progress down the City right again. Jordi Alba doing what he can. Aubameyang just had his ankles clipped. Bernardo Silva with smiles, apologises, the two exchange pleasantries, and at the end of that, Barcelona will have a free kick. Too far out for a shot. Rafinha hovering over the ball. Floats it in and City get it away. And then, oh, it's an equaliser on the near post from Aubameyang. It was helped into the air and Aubameyang hit the volley low and firm. But I suspect Ortega may feel that he should have saved it. He didn't. And Barcelona are level. Just seen the rerun, it's just that little nudge that's catch near Palmer, the goalkeeper. It's his position, that front post, as Aubameyang just tries to slice the ball back across. He can't let the ball through there, the near post. Again, two mistakes from both goalkeepers. Looks to me as though Ortega is trying to anticipate that the volley's going to go across him to the far side, so he starts to move his weight ever so slightly to the right and Aubameyang hits it to the left and in the end he has to sort of lunge a left boot at it and because of that it just opened up that near post a little bit more here is Wilson Esbrand making terrific strides forward into visiting territory gets all the way to the edge of the box actually before Bus gets sorry uh, PK gets in the way of him and now City are in with a chance to make it two and it Nearly was two, and it still could be two terrific stops, and this could be a third chance. Alvarez doing what he can. Mares then tries to bend it in. How on earth did that stay out? Two excellent saves from a goalkeeper who gifted City the opening goal in the first half, denying Alvarez not once but twice from very close in. Uh, that was proper friendly action. You wouldn't normally get that many opportunities as a striker in the area, but Alvarez had two really big ones. Both of them were stopped, and then Mares put it wide. So making progress down City's left. The ball is won back by the Blues, and Rodri taps it back to John Stones. Oh, they've lost it, the Blues. Great save by Ortega, and then slammed in the referee has allowed play to continue, Franco de Jong has smashed in the rebound, City were just caught playing it out from the back, Ortega made a save and then it just popped out and Franco de Jong following up from midfield, slammed it into the back of the net. It's there as he just falls really, really nicely, doesn't it? De Jong playing out, get caught, goalkeeper, good touch, it's difficult after that. Pressure's on, square pass, you've got to be careful you don't make. Take it comes out, good save, but so comfortable with Dion, he's pushing it into the net. Capitalised his players. So his corner is cleared, and then there's a 
terrific shot and then a chance is hit over the bar it was Joao Cancelo who clobbered it in from maybe about 30 metres from goal it was travelling at pace Reuner works it through the middle and outside it goes now to Riyad Mahrez and Mahrez along the line and City will score and it's Cole Palmer a tap in on the line beautifully worked by the Blues Joao Cancelo on the overlap saw the run of Cole Palmer and Palmer on the far post just moving in off the wing tapped it over the line brilliant from Joao Cancelo just that little reverse pass the ball fizzes right across the six yard box Riyad Mahrez delaying it and once the ball comes across Brilliant Cole Palmer getting into those areas. The overloads from City in wide areas were excellent. And that's top level football. And here he is now. Does Barcelona think, how do they adjust? Marlon's getting stripped. Some great moves. Some of the movement, fabulous just to watch. See these top players, more of a relaxed atmosphere. And a chance, and the flag has stayed down. And Memphis Depay has given Barcelona the lead. Yeah, it was a great goal, they worked it well, they were starting to move things around. Well, does so well, just picking it out, but you've got to know where your centre forward is, you've got to open your body as the two centre backs, especially right near the sort of the penalty spot. Mr. Depay just comes and sweeps it in to the far corner, but you've got to get tighter. Here comes City surging forward, and they've got plenty in this attack as well. Oscar Bob is a wide left-hand player, but he's not going to get to that. Oh, and Haaland loses his footing just at the moment he was thinking about shooting. And the referee has pointed for a penalty, I think. Well, it's a strange situation. He's just got caught. Christensen just ran across him. Amazing, really, same as that contact there. His foot's right out. He's sure he's given the correct decision. Morris is clearly City's designated penalty taker. And he is about to step up and he's about to thump it into the roof of the net and City have made it 3-3. Well, I think we've learned something tonight, haven't we there, Michael? The designated City penalty taker, even when Haaland is on the pitch, is Riyad Mahrez. And this one has ended in a draw as well. Michael, what have we learned tonight? I think it was a great game, wonderful occasion, 91,000 people to the two managers embrace with smiles. I think that's probably something that they're both delighted with, three, three draw and some great run outs, seen some flashes from the young players. So Rico Lewis being able to play in this such big game, Cole Palmer getting minutes, see youngsters as well coming on after that was great to see. Some